Tutorial on File Selector for Orchestrations launched from an Enterprise One page. Hi, in this tutorial, let's see how we can select files as input when we launch an orchestration from an Enterprise One page. An orchestration is a powerful automation tool to simplify business processes. And one of the easiest and most effective way to put that part to use is to allow users to launch orchestration right from Enterprise One pages. Using orchestration, Many business processes and transactions can be simplified into a few simple inputs. This feature enhances the capabilities of Enterprise One Pages to provide a file selector so that we can easily supply file inputs. And if the orchestration returns files as outputs, this feature also allows us to download those files to our desktop. In this tutorial, let's consider a scenario in which we want to make it easy for users to report broken equipment. They simply need to provide the equipment number, a brief description of the problem and a picture of the broken equipment. First, let us create a simple orchestration that creates a work order using the Enterprise One Maintenance Work Order Program. The orchestration will also accept the file as input and automatically attach that file to the work order so that the users can upload the image of the broken equipment. In this orchestration, we have set equipment number and problem description as the orchestration inputs. In the file inputs tab, we have configured process files individually option and the file upload format as JPG, which in this example is the image of the broken equipment. Our orchestration simply has two steps, a form request to create the work order and an attachment step to upload the file as an attachment to the work order. Now, let's see how we can call this orchestration from an Enterprise One page. From the Login Username drop-down menu, select Manage Content under the Personalization category and then Composed Pages. Now, let's add an orchestration tile and click Configure Tile button to open the Configure Tile pop-up. Click the Select Orchestration or Notification icon besides the Orchestration Name field to access the associate orchestration wizard. Select the report broken equipment orchestration that we have created in studio. Click save. Click OK in the configure tile dialog box. Save and close the enterprise one page. Click the report broken equipment tile. In the enter input pop-up box, provide inputs for equipment number and the problem description as the orchestration inputs. Because the orchestration is configured to accept a file as input, the Enterprise One page automatically presents the File Input tab. In the File Input tab, upload the image file of the broken equipment. This is the file that will be stored as an attachment to the work order. Click OK. The orchestration is executed and the work order is generated with the file you selected as an attachment. Now, let's go check our work order. Go to the Search for Equipment Work Order application. Search for the order number that is generated in the previous step. We can now see that the work order is created and equipment number and problem description are displayed in the order. Click the attachment icon to see the attachment manager. You can see the uploaded image. If you launch an orchestration that is configured to provide files in its output, this feature also lets you download those files to your local desktop. For this tutorial, let's consider an example in which we have an orchestration that generates a list of equipment at the status of down and provides that list in its output as a comma-separated value field. Create an orchestration tile in the Enterprise One page and associate the list equipment down orchestration to this tile. When you click this tile, the orchestration is executed and returns a file response that can be downloaded by clicking the download file button. This file will be downloaded to the browser default download directory. A confirmation message will appear if you close the output pop-up without downloading the file. Launching orchestration from Enterprise One page is one of the easiest and most effective ways to put the power of orchestration to use. And now that we can select file inputs and receive file outputs, we have even more opportunities to automate business processes. To learn more about File Selector for orchestration launched from an Enterprise One page, Visit running orchestration and notification from designer pane in the using and approving user defined objects guide.
For more information, visit us at learnjd.com. Thanks for watching.